Hello, I'm Simona Millam and I'd like to welcome you to this course on what's new in Office 2016. And in this introductory nugget, all I want to do is give you an overview of what we're covering, but also to give you some suggestions as to how to get the most out of this course and how to get the most out of Office 2016. And you'll see that we're covering the core Office applications, so that's Excel, Word, PowerPoint, Outlook and OneNote. So, the 2016 version of Microsoft Office was available to business customers from the 1st of October 2015, but that might vary slightly if you purchased your Office licenses through Office 365. And in fact, Office 365 signals exciting times for Microsoft Office with a more regular update cycle for new features. And indeed, one or two of the features I'm going to cover in this course are actually only available to Office 365 subscribers, but I will highlight those as we go. Now, in order to learn about the new features of Office 2016, you could, of course, have gone onto the Microsoft website and read through a great long list of feature names and descriptions, but I'm really glad that you chose to follow this course instead because my aim is to bring all of those features to life with some real-world examples. So I'm not only going to be showing you how to use the new features, but also showing you why you might want to use them and, and therefore hopefully sparking ideas in your own minds as to how you can use this new functionality in your day-to-day -day work with Microsoft Office. So with that in mind, I suggest that you download the Nuggets Lab files available from the course page because I would love you to be following along as we create the new charts or whatever or as we try out the new morph PowerPoint transition that would really help with your learning and just one other thing to mention is that although I have ordered the nuggets into a sequence which I think makes for interesting viewing if you think to yourself well actually I'm first of all interested in all of the Excel stuff then that's no problem you can watch all of the Excel nuggets first of all and then pick up the other ones as you see fit that would work absolutely fine so it's great that you've taken the step to, to, to work through this course with me, but can you see that it would be such a shame if you carried on using Microsoft Office as if it were an older version from, from many years ago? So my mission is that by the end of the course, you've seen at least a few features that you think you will use and could actually have the potential to change and improve the way that you work in Microsoft Office. I hope this has been informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing.